The 36th annual Round the Fountain Art Fair is this weekend in Lafayette. Some of the art fair's proceeds benefit local arts programs. Board member Jim Bodenmiller joins us in the studio along with Terry Jackson from Jefferson High School's art program, which benefits from the fair. Gentlemen, thanks for coming in. Thank You're you, welcome. Sue. Well, Jim, I know there's about 90 artists surrounding mm. the courthouse square this weekend, um, but you have some new ones. Tell us about them. We do. Uh, um, every year we try to have about um, a third of the artists who are new first-time participators. So uh, this year we have uh, several that are um, from all different um, uh, states throughout the, uh, the Midwest and also some local artists that have not been in the fair before. So uh, one artist is uh, does a beautiful mixed-media vases that um, I think are a very unique kind of art form. Um, there are others that have been there before, but I think we have about a total of seven local artists that are participating. Old standbys like Scott Frankenberger and, uh, and um, some of the others that have been here before. So. Tell us about the, how the proceeds from the event are used. Um, every year we do generate some proceeds, and over the years we have um, uh, brought <coughs> used that money to support community activities. And in the past, when uh, courthouse restoration was going on, we, we used funding to do different projects there. In the last several years, we have di diverted the uh, that revenue to support the visual arts programs in our five uh, local high schools. So we feel very good about being able to support those programs in, in the local high schools. That's where Terry comes in. You have to benefit from some of the proceeds. Yes, it's really wonderful. Um, there's just so many ways that we use that money. Um, we enter competitions. We need s supplies for scholarships. Um, things break down. We teach uh, so many different areas, and there's just things that break down, and we need them right away. Plus, one of the more important things is that some of our students come up with ideas that we hadn't anticipated, and they may need some supplies or paints or something that uh, we can go out and get that. And it's really been a benefit to our school, and I'm sure for all of the different area high schools. All right, the Round the Fountain Art Fair is this Saturday from 9 o'clock in the morning until 4.30 in the afternoon at the Courthouse Square. Gentlemen, thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you.